Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I know I look different than in my last video. I'm wearing hair extensions. I don't like my hair right now because it needs a trim. Like, it just has a lot of dead ends. So, I'm waiting until I get my hair cut. Even though my hair is already short, it just needs like a fresh look. And um, that's gonna be like next week. So, for now, I'll just probably be wearing hair extensions until I get my fresh haircut. It's not gonna be a lot shorter than what it is. It's just gonna look more fresh. So, that's gonna happen. All right, so today's vlog is gonna be about my car getting the windshield tinted. I've been wanting to get the front windshield tinted for a while and especially after I got the whole car wrapped, the windshield that I had on earlier, like it had a tint stroke, it just was not looking good and also had a bad crack on it. So what happened was I actually got it replaced and then I got a brand new windshield. My car insurance only charged me $50 copay, which was really nice. So as soon as I got a new front windshield, I got this one tinted to 35%. So now my whole car is tinted in 35%. Definitely looks a lot better so I'm about to show you guys what it looks like and in this vlog I'm also gonna show you what it looks like on the inside during the day and at night unfortunately it's not sunny today and it won't be sunny like this whole entire week it's just raining so I can't show you guys what it looks like in the Sun all right I'm about to show you guys what the whole car looks like tinted and 35% Okay, so this is the before the 35% tint. This has no tint whatsoever. Still looks kind of dark with the reflection, which is pretty shocking. <laughs> but from the side, you can see the window, that tint that I have here, which is 35% and none here. So you can see the difference. Okay, so that's definitely not tinted, and that's tinted right here at 35%. So yeah, there's definitely a difference inside the car. Alright, let's go get my car's windshield tinted. I'm excited, but a little nervous, just because I don't want to get pulled over, but we'll just see what happens. I just want a complete badass look, so. All right guys, I'm gonna go drop off my car now and then I'll pick it up and show you what it looks like. Guys, I'm here to get my car picked up. Ooh. Yeah, that is dark. <laughs> it looks so good, wow. Oh my God, I love it. <laughs> So it's cloudy today, not sunny, which is not really the best way to show you guys what it looks like from the outside when it's sunny. And unfortunately this whole week it's raining so I'm not going to get much sun. But yeah, this is what it looks like tinted during the daylight. And I like seriously don't even need to wear any shades because there's no type of light that's bothering my eyes. So like no sunlight. It's seriously so amazing. I the worst for going off-roading in this car but off-roading has like the best places I think it looks so good
guys, so yeah, I just dropped my car at night and definitely noticed the difference. It is darker for sure, uh, but there is a benefit. So like people's lights, like their headlights, don't bother my eyes as much now because of the tint. So there's that benefit, but yeah, it's definitely darker and um, I would not recommend it for somebody who does not have good eyesight. Definitely make sure that you can see at night first before you tint all your windows in 35%. You could probably go lighter and you'll be fine, but 35 all around is pretty dark. Yeah, I definitely see a difference, but I love it. I feel like there's so much more privacy now. And um, for people who kind of want to feel like no one can see them, is definitely a plus. Let's see if I get pulled over for it, but there are uh, ways around it. So if you have like sensitive eyes, you can get a prescription where the cops just let you get away with that. Like they can't um, argue with you if it's a medical condition. So in Michigan, um, that's kind of what people do here when they get their windows tinted. I don't know about other states or countries, but overall Michigan is less strict than California because I did live in Cali for 18 years and uh, uh, cops were definitely more strict about tinted windows and stuff like that so i'll show you guys what it looks like at night i'll record while driving you can get an idea of how dark it is inside my car like during this hour it is like 10 p.m now thank you everybody for watching and i will see you guys next time